first time in my lifetime I forgot my problems. You guys know why? Because I woke up on an island. Why wouldn't I forget my problems knowing that my body, soul and spirit are immersed in nature? Can you hear the sound of the ocean waves? Can you all feel the breeze of the ocean? I mean, can you hear the chirping birds? Listen carefully. The breeze in here is so good to the extent that even the trees in here are so happy that they keep on wiggling and jiggling just to praise God. <laughs> Why do I say so? Don't tell me you're not going to forget your problems with this view. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Blue Moon! luxurious eco resort located in the western region Axim and Ajan to be precise okay. it has a peninsula which during the high tides it closes up and making the whole peninsula look like an island okay. and that peninsula is also housing four residents which are four buildings mm. which is chalets two chalets and two villas all with a private swimming pool and then a personalized butler service which is offered on that peninsula and now in Ghana we normally call it in our, in our island it's very iconic and it is an experience worth having <laughs> Today is one of the happiest day in my life. You know why? Because I found peace. I mean, peace is underrated. And this is what this resort gives me. It gives me peace that I'm looking for. You know, when you're looking for peace, you need to look peace within you and around you. And this is what I have today. My goodness. I feel like I have five words to describe this place. It's so peaceful, serene, exquisite. Listen, got a touch of luxury. And finally, this place is so therapeutic. I'm so excited to be seeing you all again and I want to welcome you all back to the YouTube channel and I know and believe that we all can turn a blind eye for the fact that I have been away for a month. It's actually not a month, it's been two months offline. I was so excited for the new year and I had so much plans for you all. Everything was going on perfectly fine until I got hit by a storm. The storm was so heavy that my ankle almost drift. But I have an anchor that keeps the soul, so I had to pause, rest, refresh, and restart. Did you miss me? Was my absence off this YouTube street really felt? Am I still your favorite content creator? <laughs> I'm so excited to be back again. Please like this video and let them know that the annoying village boy is back and we're back for good.
Do you know what is going through my mind right now? I feel like buying one of the chalets to become my private home. You know, we got five chalets on the island and every private chalet got its own pool. Listen, what even blows my mind to the extent that some of the rooms, you could see rocks like this in there. It means they built around the rocks, the trees, none of the trees were cut down. That's incredible. It's more like eco-friendly, protected nature, letting nature, I mean, take care of you while you take care of it. <laughs> and this is my region. And I want to tell you that this is the exact same way the Enzimas build their house. So whatever architect that you've seen were built by the locals from the place. And I can testify because I am from here. My goodness, waking up on an island and an island filled with greens. And you go down, you see blues. I mean, greens and blues makes the perfect combination. My goodness, I love this place. I keep on telling you that Africa is the Garden of Eden. God took his time to create Africa for Africans. And it's about time Africans cherish it, especially the men. Grab Africa the way you grab your woman. I keep on saying it. You can't find this anywhere. I don't know why most Africans spend most of their money to go to Bali whilst they can come to Axim, the western region of Ghana, to enjoy without buying flight ticket. When you come here and spend time here, you're empowering the locals around here because everybody that works in here is from here. A big round of applause for the owner of this place and the fact that it's owned by Ghanaian. A round of applause, man. But hey, I didn't come here alone. I came here with my brother and my two trainers. This is more like me thanking them for transforming me from that to what you're seeing right now. round of applause to them so I just want to say thank you so they are actually living their best life hey Woody hi how are you wow you guys are looking good it's relaxing being here, I think. You can even see from my skin, it's already growing now. Wow. And my face is now calm now. Look cool. Yes. How's the place? I love the place. You know, this place is so serene Ooh. and peaceful and luxurious all at the same time. There are views in every direction, so I couldn't be happier. Wow. Mm -hmm. I mean, the journey here, you know, we work out. So I actually trained a client before coming, so I was really stressed. The first thing I did when we got here, Jump in the pool. So I did that, took my bath. And the bath is amazing. So I, you know, I was a little extra, so I took my bath. I had rose petals and the whole nine. Yeah. And the breakfast? Yeah, the breakfast, yeah. How was it? This is not your regular Ghanaian breakfast. Because it's good the way they serve the food calls meal. But my question is how is the place in general for you guys, man? Can I tell you, I've been to resorts all over the world, Switzerland, Italy, Croatia, this marvel. Yeah, Why so, do you say so? I mean, the listen, like I don't know if you, you know, the people can hear, but just the ocean, the, the, yeah. the, um, the breeze, the sound of the ocean. I mean, it's Ghana. The weather is absolutely beautiful all the time and amazing. And I, look where, you know, where we worked out. and having the views 360 everywhere you are. It's and the staff, is, it's so nice. It's so nice. Incredible. For the first time working out and just with the breeze, 
hardly really sweat because it's, it's quite natural because of the, the airflow. It's, 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 it's amazing. And, and yeah. Have you guys noticed one unique thing about this place? The fact that you can actually open the door and enjoy the breeze whilst you sleep. Mm -hmm. Did you guys do that last night? Oh, that's what we did. Well, let me tell <laughs> How you. How did you know? Let me tell you. <laughs> Slept with the door completely open. I barely slept and it was on purpose because I wanted to savor every moment. And yeah. the sunrise is earlier in Africa than, yeah. than the US. And yeah. I didn't want to miss it. So literally, maybe I got like two hours of sleep, but I'm fine, I'm energized. Yeah. You know, I got to see the sunrise this morning. So, so I think this place doesn't hide the view from you. Even mm -hmm. with the bathtub, you have an open I mean, um, area that you can just see the sea breeze as you take your bath, it's, it's, it's just everywhere. It's, it's dope. Everywhere, it's like you are indoors, outdoors at the same time. And it's amazing. I That's just want to tell you guys, you've not seen anything yet. We There's are on more. the island. I'm going to mm -hmm. take you guys to the mainland and you Ooh. are going to live your best life. Right. Are you ready? I am I'm ready. ready to live my best life. I'm, I'm ready. always ready to live my best <laughs> you guys, life. You guys, I'm ready. You See you guys. <laughs> 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 We also do have our mainland, which have the bay view, and then the hillside rooms, which also can house um, 23 people maximum. But all our rates are for two. Okay. So immediately you book or make payment or reservation, you are already having two people. We are already looking up to having two guests in-house. So this is our infinity pool, hmm. which is for all our guests in-house. And sometimes we do have day visitors who will not like to swim in the sea, hmm. but rather like to have a pool experience. We also have this so that they can swim in the pool. As many choices as you have, you want, you can have it in Lumun. What are the things that when you come in here, you can do for fun? Fun, Lumun is fun. Actually, Coming in here is already fun because looking at the journey, the turns and the tricks and when you arrive in here, the fun has just begun. Wow. We have hiking through the forest. Okay. Then when you come in here after the hiking, there is an exercise where we will join the tour guards, walk through the beach barefooted, which is a therapeutic uh, where, uh, where the health activity. Then we have bicycle ride through the town. Then we also have an archery <laughs> where we try how to uh, shoot arrows. Then we have the table tennis. We have the board games. Then we have mini golf course over here. So much to do. Kayaking, boat ride, and a lot. Kayaking on the sea? Sure. That would be so much fun. Wow. Just give, I wish you could try it today, but... Yeah, definitely. I'm going to try it today. But is it affordable to live in Lomon? Very, very affordable. Very, very, very affordable. affordable. Believe me or not, I have been here and I will tell you that this is a perfect place for your honeymoon. Don't come here alone. Like I said, you'll be depressed if you come here alone. You need to come with a loved one, immerse yourself in nature, enjoy the peaceful atmosphere. And apart from that, you, got, you know what you got to do? You need to make babies in here. <laughs> So <laughs> unfortunately, I came alone, but I know that my trainer definitely made a baby last night. I, I heard it. I heard him, man. I heard him. <laughs> With it, this fresh coconut from Lumu, and anyone who enters Lumu, and you know, in Zima land, it's a land of coconut. So when you come to Lumu and we don't give you coconut, then you are not welcome. So you have to take coconut. And when you leave, you can spread the good news of Lumu and the freshness of nature. Please.
Seven. One thing about coconut from the western region it tastes better than all the coconut you find anywhere in Ghana. Mm -hmm. I like this part. <laughs> Sorry. Good toast, yeah? yeah. Alright, so, so good life, long life, more money, more success. Yeah. Wow! wow. <laughs> <laughs> After a long day of activities. Well, I spent the day in the spa, so oh. that was my activity. You had a massage. I had, had a massage good, on the beach. I had a good kayaking. You know, everything was fine, by the way. And um, it's about time to have dinner on the beach. Woo. The good view, a good sound, the background. So the breeze, nice. man. Breeze. I, I hope my food doesn't get cold. <laughs> Personally, I love, I love. The, the sound of the sea is, is relaxing. There's something about it. I don't know. I don't know. Exactly. Do I mean, people will say the sea is a form of therapy. Yes, it is. right. It is. Well, it now really that you mention that, we don't train everyone the way we train you. Yeah. We've actually been we had some retreats where we just had the people literally sleep. Yeah. Sleep and eat healthy. Sleep on the beach because their cortisone levels were so high. If they were to train the way we trained you, we'd just stress them out more, mm. stress their bodies out more, and they would their bodies wouldn't have reacted, they wouldn't have lost any weight. Wow. So we had proper nutrition, lots of sleep and light training. And I mean the result was within the I, mean, I, I think, think I think I think uh, one side of ours actually gained um, some results like had had some reduction in weight just by sleeping by the beach and just having a good a good um, um, why is it yeah, Oh my it's god! Like, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm literally not listening to anyone. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Here. Can I use my hand? <laughs> I can use my hand. Thank you. Right, right, right. So this is what we call it in French. We say bon appétit. Yeah. <laughs> right, diving, bro. <laughs> All right, see you later, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. I'm from the Western region and I want to let you know that the best comes from the West and it's about time you all come and experience, I mean, the best in the West. Yeah, Maya. Peace out. Time is moving fast. We slow down.